Hey everybody, day 25 of the Get Down and Do It Push-Up Challenge. Jim here. Uh, finished my 100 push-ups for the day. Pretty excited about that. It's almost 9 o'clock at night. Um, yeah, what an exciting evening it has been so far. Uh, to celebrate my 25th, 100th, 2500th push-up, my cat decided to vomit all over the attic. And... Uh, I'm sure I'll have to clean that up. And I don't have any paper towels either. But I came down here and did this anyway. I think I'll just let it soak into the rug real good before I get it. My cat Sotheby, when he vomits, you know, it's not like a, like a normal cat. You know, he doesn't just get sick in one place. He doesn't just go over to the corner and just puke his guts out like a normal cat. You know, all you guys have cats, right? Cats that they, they cough up these hairballs and everything. No. It's not what Sotheby does. What he does, and let me see if I can look in the mirror here. Imagine that like right here is the cat, okay? What he does is, <clears throat> well first actually what he does is he, he signals he's gonna get sick with this low meows. He's like, Mrow! you know? <laughs> and, he, and he does that a few times. Like tonight he, he was over in his litter box and he was like making this sound. He does actually meow a lot in the litter box. I don't know why. But he, he was making this really sick sound, and my wife said, he's going to be sick. So, instead of, of course, staying in the litter box, you know, where it all could have been nice and contained, he went over under my wife's desk, and he picked that spot, you know? That's what I was telling you about. Like, he picks a spot here. And then what he does is he does this thing where he, he, he goes, Bleh! and he backs up from himself. And as he backs up, he vomits, you see? And so he spreads the vomit all over in long lines and then he vomits like three or four times that's what he does and it's uh you know i don't know it's it's disgusting it's disgusting i can't there's no way to deal with it you know we need to have carpet shampoo on hand at all times the cat's uh nine now you know we just switched him to friskies and uh i don't know i guess i saw a deal in the store 46 cents a can and i thought maybe he could live on that stuff it's supposed to be better than dry right i don't know anyway here we are, 2,500 push-ups later, still going strong. Um, I guess I've run out of push-up material to talk about, but, you know, cat vomiting, I think I could stick with that subject for a whole week if I wanted to. This could be the cat vomit week, you know? I might even, you know, insert some keywords into YouTube so that people who are searching for cat vomit videos could land on this. And maybe those people start doing push-ups. And in, in that way, when you look at it, the cat could have been doing people good by vomiting in my attic on our carpeting up there, in our family room, in our business office. The cat could have been inspiring people all across the world to do push-ups, a hundred a day, five days a week, at getdownanddoit.com. So, Sotheby, thank you very much. This episode goes out to you. Take care, everybody. Bye.